transferring data from the 1730 energy logger. We've been recording for some time using our uh, demo case over here. Been logging for a while and what we want to do now is we want to be able to extract some of that data. Um, we, what we have here is a USB port. So if you look at the top of this under the hood here, you've got a standard USB and you've got a 2.0 USB where you can actually use a USB stick to remove the data or you can use the hard wire from here to the PC. Now the nice advantage you have with a USB is you can use this to walk up, collect the data, pull it out while it's still logging, and then come back later to grab the rest of the data. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go through and do this automatically. So as I lift the cover, I'm going to go ahead then and place in my USB stick. It will start flashing up here. So you can actually see the light flashing and it's working. And then it pulls you onto the screen <coughs> and it shows you copy and login, login sessions here to USB. I'll select that. Now I can select the most recent data logging that we've been doing here. It shows me the time and date stamp and I hit save to USB. Now it's going to go ahead and save that data via the USB. Once it's done collecting that, I'm good to pull that out. And then I can just go back to login here and then look at the login that we're doing. I can plug this into the computer. I can then open up our Fluke Energy Logger software. I can go into download data. I can grab on to this data. Hit download. Now it shows me all the data that I've got available and I can use the software to extract all the information that's important to me. The other way to go about taking the data from this is to go into the memory and settings. Here go into login sessions and now go ahead and scroll up and down. Select the data that you would like with the time and date stamp and then upload that either via the USB port or using the USB stick.